Ario is a 2.5D action platformer game. In Ario, you play as a boy named Ario. He's on an adventure to save his mum who's been captured in a land full of curses. Ario makes me think of Prince of Persia, which I'm pretty sure was an inspiration for this game. If you're after a whimsical, lighthearted game, then this could be the game for you. Just know that Ario is a quick game. The game has 12 unique levels, each with their own enemies and bosses. Here is what the developer Varta Games has to say about the game on Steam. Ario will start a journey to rescue his missing mother from a land plagued by nightmares and curses, only to find himself immersed in a dark battle for his life against powerful dark forces. Join him along the way as he faces plenty of challenges and hazards, fights demons and mechanic enemies, explores abrupt cliffs and meets new allies and foes in an epic journey for revenge. It's a good description and sets your expectations well. In this game, you run and jump around trying to get from the left side of the screen to the right. You have to fight bad guys along the way, but there's a problem. It feels kind of weird to play. When you move in Aria, if you take your finger off the movement, he just stops really suddenly and there's no inertia to the movement, which can be a bit jarring if I'm honest. And combat is limited to charging at enemies, butt smashing enemies, or firing your bow at them. Then there are parts where you control big crossbows and shoot at enemies. It's slow and not very exciting. The game says it's an action adventure with a bit of tower of defense, but it doesn't always fit in with the levels and can really break up the flow of the game. Ario does have a great intro level, which teaches you the controls and how to navigate around the game world. My only issue with the intro is I didn't find all the move controls that simple or obvious to understand. Maybe that's a me issue, or maybe it could be made clearer. A lot of the feedback I've seen, which I agree with, is the length of the game. It's a bit short. Now hopefully the developer could add some more levels in an update or as DLC. Aria was released on March the 28th this year and is available now on Steam.